Taking on Audi, BMW and Mercedes is no easy task. So the new Lexus IS does things a bit differently. That means a hybrid instead of the usual diesel engines, plenty of standard equipment, plus angular, very Japanese styling. But it's still chasing the same customers, so can it beat the Germans at their own game? The new IS comes as a four-door saloon only, and with a choice of two engines, the petrol IS250 or hybrid IS300H. Prices for the 250 start at around £26,500, but you'll need to part with £3,000 more for the hybrid we're driving today. If you thought hybrids were just for eco-warriors, think again. The combined output of this hybrid engine is about the same as a BMW 325 diesel. The instant torque of the electric motor gives you really punchy acceleration around town, and it's near silent at low speeds too. Hybrids achieve very low emissions in the EU tests. So low, in fact, that the IS300 SE actually qualifies for free car tax. Official fuel economy is 65.7 miles per gallon, but the smaller Lexus CT hybrid fell short of its figures in our more realistic tests. Click the link below to find out more. The hybrid's very refined if you're just cruising around, but it does get noisy if you accelerate hard. This automatic gearbox holds the engine at constant revs, which can make it sound a bit droney, although it's not as bad as some of the cheaper Toyota hybrids. Inside, the IS is more reserved, with high quality materials providing a premium feel. Check out these touch sensitive heating controls. Unfortunately, I just can't get on with this Lexus media system. This mouse style controller here is really difficult to use while driving, and you often have to navigate several menus to perform quite simple tasks. You've got to love this parking navigation service though. It searches all the car parks in your area and tells you which ones have free spaces and how much they cost. The boots are similar size to the 3 Series, although you only get a tyre repair kit rather than a proper spare wheel in the hybrid. Like its main rivals, the Lexus is rear-wheel drive and it feels quite sporty from behind the wheel. Crucially though, it also rides really well. There's also an active sound control system that plays engine noise through the stereo speakers, but while it makes the car sound louder, it doesn't really make it sound any sportier. Lexus is known for its reliability, but we carry out the biggest owner survey in the UK. Click the link below to find out more. Low emissions make the hybrid the obvious choice for company car drivers, but don't rule out the IS250 petrol if you're buying with your own money. It's £3,000 cheaper, which goes a long way to making up for those higher fuel bills. The IS hybrid offers diesel levels of fuel economy and superb refinement. It isn't quite as good to drive as the benchmark BMW, but you do get more for your money. So while it isn't perfect, the IS makes a strong case for daring to be different. Click the links below to read our full lab test reviews for the old Lexus IS plus the BMW 3 Series and Mercedes C-Class.